cells held convicts that were too sick to be housed down the stairs. So hospital bed, those are real artifacts, the bed pans and the like. The only thing that belongs to this cell, Justin, would be the beds and the bed pans yeah. and blankets and such. All the other equipment really belongs to what we're standing out here with the docs and nurses would be oh, working. Yeah, yeah. But since uh, some things started walking away, we've locked them up. Oh. So, these are where they keep a guy if he had surgery. This is where they keep a man if uh, you know, he just had such a long term illness and needed help. And the cell that Justin's heading in right now is how long the cell. Very sick at the end of his day. Yeah. Wow. Did three months at cell, Justin is now, and then was paroled because of his health. He died of three men, suffered a stroke, he was 48 years old. And he had untreated for years, it was a, a death sentence. Yes, yes. So if you can go through this wall, it's uh -huh. 10 feet thick of masonry, you'd be in the shower room where you pick up the audio equipment. That's the shower room. So that's back mm -hmm. there where you were. There's a lot of construction. Birthday, this was built in 1909. And it was built by the army as a prison. And they built this wing as their prison hospital. Wow. And it served that same purpose. This is hospital to the closure of the prison, which we just celebrated a couple nights ago. Really? March 1963 is the closing date of Alfred Tress. So it's just you're here 46 years and 46. three days. Wow. Now, Dustin, and most of the deaths on the island yeah. occurred in the operating room. All right. What kind of disease men would for 